What would happen if your professor actually happened to agree with every single translation choice of the 54 plus multilanguage experts, Greek, Hebrew, Latin scholars, and other multilanguage and English usage experts of the King James Bible? Hi, I'm David Daniels from Chick Publications. What would happen? In most major institutions, he'd probably be out of a job. See, his employers would come to him and say, why do we need you? What new thing do you bring to the table? Why, they could simply read and believe the King James Bible. They don't need you. Exactly. Okay, well, actually, the truth is, if he were to teach them to read, to believe, to understand, to research, to find their answers in God's holy and preserved words, he could be bringing about another Moody, another Spurgeon, another Wesley, another Billy Sunday, or a whole generation of them. Because to believe God's words like this promotes faith, brings faith, is faith. Romans 10, 17, faith cometh by hearing and hearing by the word of God. Doubt never brings faith. But doubting is what's usually expected of professors. But brothers and sisters, the title of professor does not confer wisdom upon us. You see, if I or any professor gets new ideas, then the more followers we get. The more followers we get, the more cronies we have. The more cronies and approval, the better reputation we gain. And then one day, Thomas Nelson comes knocking on our door and they say, Wow, we've got a great book deal for you and we'd love to promote you. We have the promoters, we have the staff, we have the advertising. If only you would use one of our Bibles, say the New King James. And if I or any of those professors falls for it, the scripture becomes true concerning us. Romans 1.22, professing themselves to be wise, they became fools. Not only that, but also 2 Corinthians 10 verse 12, where it says, but they, measuring themselves by themselves and comparing themselves among themselves, are not wise. We must compare and conform ourselves to the truth, God's holy and preserved words, the King James Bible. To conform ourselves to anything else is not wise. God bless you and have a great day.